Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, of course, as you probably know by now, and welcome back to Old World Blues, in which we are at war, not with the uh, Super Mutants yet, but the Cyphers. I think actually last time I guaranteed them, but I've already taken over Mesa Verde, which, well, within the first 15 seconds of the video, we already took them out, which is very, very nice. we got quite a few comments to go through, even though I do plan on taking out uh, a couple, um, as we'll say, a Baja residents down here as f fast as possible, uncivil civilian unrest. Well, that's alright. Put them in their place. They deserve to be put in their place. A ship of the line is very, very nice. Cool. Um, a lot of you guys recommend we do do a full wasteland conquest, which I think we will. We probably will at this point. We might as well, since we're already this this deep. So, how's it going in? Uh, we free military factories? God, overall blues. <sighs> what a mod. We have plenty of scraps. So there you go. I wonder if we can do well on the attack. Hopefully. Oh, no. They've called in their allies. Whatever will we do? We'll destroy them as well. Cool. Yeah, we'll do a waste on conquest. Um, apparently, as several guys, several of you guys have mentioned in the comments from the last video, there uh, there is a submod to remove the special forces cap. I guess I technically could use it, but I don't know. I don't like. Well, I shouldn't say I don't like using submods sometimes, but I don't know. It is what it is. I'll put it like that. It is what it is. I, I might use it someday. We'll see. Even though that might. Is that a game rule? Is that a game rule you can establish in the beginning of the game? Like, you don't care if, like, you have, like, unlimited power armor? God, that sounds like a lot of fun. UNLIMITED POWER ARMOR! But, Ace Pilot promoted very good. Very bueno. Actually, what is the damage we're doing right now? It's only two. 1.6. We have 400 gunships in the air. Uh, but they are attacking us too, which is kind of sad, but if you like to read about traders from Hawaii, please go right again. We could use a little bit more war support, not gonna lie. A little bit more war support. But after this, we gotta continue. Figuring out who we might uh, take out next, as well as address the situation regarding the cowboy country um, and the other nations. Here, yeah, we can do that. Thank you very much. I don't remember how much money we had. Western Bolif at the Hoover Dam. Well, that looks really cool. What is that? Well, the Hoover Dam was, for many years after its construction, an impassable barrier across the Colorado River. Shortly before the Great War, the Americans embarked on an ambitious engineering project to tackle this under the direction of the U.S. Corps of Engineers. Civilian contractors constructed two boat lifts, glorified docks, one on either side of the dam. While theoretically designed to improve trade up and down the river, the locks never opened to civilian traffic before the Great War began. They are, however, far from broken. A few months of work could, do, could restore them to functioning ability. That's actually really cool. The western boat level will be restored to working order, allowing friendly vessels to circumnavigate the Hoover Dam. That's actually cool. I don't think I've ever done that one before. Let's try it. And I close out this one. Uh, repair the next turbine, please. Thank you very much. We could spend PP here, but... And rebuild all this stuff. Oh, of course, some more stuff as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I'm building infrastructure. So, uh, okay, so let's talk about this one real quick. Um, so, someone said, accepting the Cowboys Country non-aggression pact might have made the ability to annex them disappear. Someone also said that uh, they might have gone up a puppet tier in which we couldn't annex them then. So, I, I don't know, but let's go ahead and just try this again. So we're here, are, are they considered a puppet of us yet? They are considered an enclave influence region of the United States. And as someone else would say, we should really just focus on one group at a time, trying to annex them instead of just doing like a lot of them at the different times. So that is probably for the better. Even though we do get like, what, three political power every single day? Not enough. I kinda wanna play as a royal again. I remember getting like, well, we almost get four day, Jesis Christ. But we almost get, uh, they got a lot. They got a whole lot. And someone also left a comment saying that we should take up the Sky Reavers to take Area 51 so we can get some very good infantry guns. Or fight the Zetons. Zetons. I'll see you play as a nation. But yes. Absolutely. Uh, what do we want here? Idiot Savant? We don't really need that. Skill leadership bonuses? I've never chosen that one. We actually might choose that one. You know what? If there's not much here, we could always save it for a terrain trait. But... Yeah, let's go Ninja. I almost never choose Ninja. Why not? Why not? Like the Pokemon. Cool. Uh, a lot of you guys recommend we do the Mexican options. You know, making sure that we can unite all of Mexico underneath one umbrella. We tried that before. It, it just never... It never worked for us. It, it just works. According to Todd Howard. But then you try it and it doesn't work. So, um, let's get some scrap gun trucks. Because some of you guys did say we should use some tanks and APCs. And I'll fight against the Troll War. And so, we'll see what we can do about that. Um, gunships. I'm not going to hurt that one. There you go. You go all the way to the bottom, and I think there'll be one more episode after this. Um, we'll see what happens, but yeah. Oh, uh, oh, we already have some. That's good. Thank you very much. We love Vault City. I actually do like Vault City. I, it, I, I need to play Fallout. I need to play more Fallout someday. Just time. Never enough time. So, I'm not really sure. Because we tried this before. P joins a faction? Are we in a faction right now? I mean, we're in a Love America faction, but apparently not. Mad Dog Connor shot down by Grasshopper, even though he shot down Easy Kill. Well, you win some, you lose some, I guess. Uh, here you go. 
Joshua Graham, welcome back. And be inspirational, Joshua. And your mysterious stranger, which actually suits you very, very well. Go root it for Mermarak's entrenchment and get some awareness. Very nice. Alright, go and do that, because these guys are pretty huge. Actually, that'd be really cool if we could have... Uh, I like I liked that one. Savage Eater, though, for that for now. Uh, an entire army of tanks and APCs to fight those guys off, but hey, we'll see. And he's doing great, and they're dead. As it should be. Now, we could always pair drop into these guys, but eh. I prefer beating my enemies like normal. And... Bing, 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 bing. I don't really care. And there you go. Nice. Very nice. Cool. And democracy is non-negotiable, as many of you guys did say. Of course, of course. Uh, Where is this one? I don't really care. Let's go and put it in there. That's fine with us. And... Now, well, I'm not going to choose any other one of these yet. I want to see what this does. We can keep them over people for now. Yeah, they joined the PAA. Well, they're not, there's no faction there. Oh, we do some research as you... Oh, hello. Oh, they can become free. So that might be why that we can't do some stuff. Oh, oh, we, oh yes, sophisticated tech. Yes, please. Um, I'm, I'm literally going to wait maybe for that. Or should we do this one first? Becomes a puppet of us? Huh. Very weird. But that's okay. Um, claim jumpers. Do we have anything for claim jumpers? Uh, no, we do not. So we might as well justify on them, right? Thank you very much. Yeah, I might save Mexico for the next episode. Uh, they have quite a few holes to enter through, so we gotta take those holes away. Thank you very much. You'll, they'll be fine. There's not that many guys, but that's alright. You don't need, always need a lot of guys. Sure, guys. Sure. This is half a million manpower. Not bad. Not bad. Yep, voice and conquest. I have that written down twice. Yeah, special infantry equipment in Bind Bear 1851. Also, someone else did say we should, well, I guess try out New Vegas again. Like, I should play as New Vegas again and try them out and have a good old time with them. Yeah, we, I totally should. I think I might have done all the routes for New Vegas. The King route was pretty difficult, I think, if I remember correctly. But eh, for another New Vegas route, why not? Sure. And also, someone did say for this campaign, we should release them to get the focuses done that we can do with them. We should totally get it done. So, let's see, because right now. Initiate a group rate. They need to exist. Exchange robotic technology. Oh, we got the bandits done. Thank goodness. Actually, can we pop with them? Can we form like the Me the Mexican government here? Because for this, we have recognized Vegas autonomy and Minister of Commerce to become a. Oh, they just become a puppet of us, anyways. Well, you know what? Uh, so someone wanted the, that uh, for us to get that done. So why not? Oh, New Vegas. Yes. We'll make enough PP to annex them again eventually. New Vegas, thank you. I'm a little crazy, but negotiate a group rate. With control of Nurino's pharmaceutical industry and electronics, we can arrange a trade between the two groups. Welcome back, New Vegas. Ah, oh, you're led by the king. The king. Actually, we might take these guys out first before. Uh, we'll see. Let's get out these guys first. I like these guys. And we can go to war with Cascadia, New Mariposa, whenever we want. So we're, there's really not a rush. Uh, oh, do we get... Oh, we got three days. Let's see. We got, Let's see what happens. Come on, come on. One day. Uno deo. Did it work? Oh, it did work. Okay. All right, here we go. And we now do the Mexican Reclamation Zone. We can support the opponents of Santa Ana by providing them with anomaly independent territory from which to harass the general. Better them than us. Baja Blues, the Baja Peninsula, was spared the worst of the Enclave's conquests. With little of value and occupied as the NCR was already collapsing, the Enclave's liberation passed its sleepy towns and villages by. Ranger Riley Skip Almeron was of such little note that the Enclave only sent a request that he surrender for reprocessing by courier. Needless to say, they declined, and so Almeron was even more surprised to get a request from the President to oversee the Mexican Reclamation Zone, designed to support those fleeing Santa Ana's conquests. But really, who else was going to do it? Honestly, we just like his music, the Baja State. Very cool. A musician? More stability? Wait, musicians are stable? I don't know, man. As a dude myself, I don't know about the, the whole stability thing, but secret loyalists. Daily, oh, is that good? Daily autonomy gain. I don't like that one, please. Thank you. Mexico te necesita. Well, ah, the MRZ. You look so weird. Did you have a unique focus tree? No, they do not. That kind of sucks, but whatever. We'll feed them a lot. And do that. Can we get a faction with them then? No. Expedition Force f form the Pan American Alliance. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, okay. So this one requires 
Now that Santa Ana is at war with us, our efforts to build support and resistance in Mexico have paid off. We can propose a formal alliance to defeat the general and the bull. Okay, so that kind of sucks. Although we can fight the fires of Mexican nationalism, we may not like where it leads. That actually sucks. So we actually do need Santa Ana. What happens if we were to release Santa Ana, fight him, 60% of war Mexico must support resistance to Santa Ana. Huh. Okay, and I don't like this person just because they get some more daily autonomy gain. I really don't like that. So, oh, we can't even build in the territory. Oh, big sadness. They, 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 don't, even, they don't even have a cord? Oh, that's not good. Hold on, let's, let's give it a day. Okay, now it's cord. Okay, okay, that's good. Oh, uh, we can't even build in their territory. Why? We can set a gift cap. That actually probably would be about quite a bit. Here, have like, I don't know, 2,500. No autonomy for you for now. Thank you very much. Come again. Um, really, I just want to beat up the Sky Reavers. But I don't want to use these guys up here. Yeah, let's, let's call our agents down. Agents, our military forces. Thank you. Neural interface. How about we grab some safety regulations? A little bit less factory up, 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 a little bit more HP sounds adequate. Tasty. We like those hit points. So we can take more abuse. Alright, very good. Actually, with that extra general, or... Yeah, that extra general there. We're going to need more planes, of course. And gunships? Yes, yes. God, just gunning down your enemies from above. There you go, Joshua Graham. Use them. Use them and abuse them. Yes, please. Okay, so we can do economic aid to these guys. Oh, so we actually take stuff from us and give it just straight up give it to them. Humanitarian relief to the Mexican Reclamation Zone? We get less war support and we give them more stuff. Improved Mexican Reclamation Zone's infrastructure. That's not bad. I don't mind doing that one. That's okay. Um, hmm. Pop it. Pop it. Last Lodge. Do shoe. Well, Forgers are first. Let's do Forgers. If we don't have to kill them off like that, then so be it. Sorry, I'm just taking time doing this. The Legion probably won't mar be marching anymore. Sponsor War Movie for more yes. More yes. Yes. Um, this stuff can be closed out for now. NCR dollars. I don't mind doing New Citizens Care Package because that's usually pretty good to do. Don't really need it right now, though. We got 1,900 Caparinos, so that's okay. And I want you guys just to go in. I don't care if they have open holes here. When can we go to war? Oh, 65 days. Why is it so long? Oh, my goodness. Why is it so, oh, so long? And even if these guys try to raid us, we'll be okay. Here's what it is. Negotiate a group rate. Jet engines, yes. A group rate. And we'll probably integrate these guys later, but exchange robotic technology. In exchange for robotic technology, we can teach New Vegas how to upgrade their weaponry. Very good. Escort carriers sound pretty good. Actually, let's start just focusing just on making a lot of ships here. And we'll get some tanks as well. Economic resurgence, great. Scavenger turn triumphant with a bonus for special forces technology. And then we'll probably do recognize Vegas autonomy. In exchange for access to New Vegas' weapons manufacturing, we're preparing to recognize its privileged status in the United States until we fully annex them. Oh, hello. Oh, we can just... Hmm. They are a federal state. Good. As it should be, my friends. As it should be. Production-wise, give us those kill dozers. God. <sighs> kill dozers. Yes, please. Alright, drop down. There you go. Share the wealth. Every man a king. Anything here? Do we care about anything we care about here? Nope. Ah, Leadville. We're going to fill a lot of people with lead, and if they don't want to join us peacefully, then we'll make sure they join us totally not peacefully. Thank you very much. Come again. And if these guys don't want to join us either, well, we got clans on your country. 40 days are not too bad. Go on in, guys. You'll do more than fine. All right. I'll keep moving, making it better. And up next, become a federal commonwealth. Puppet, 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 puppet. Heaven's Gate. Oh, let's do the last lodge, shall we? Yes. Oh. Vault City? Ah. A university town filled with university students. Not sure what I was going to say there, but probably a lot of alcohol. But anyways. Oh. Yeah. For some reason, I was like, do they drink alcohol in the wasteland? And I'm like, oh my goodness. They have mentats and all sorts of drugs. Of course they do. Yeah, in Fallout 76, you can even uh, make alcohol and moonshine and stuff like that. Just like, Apparently, I'm not thinking right now. I'm really just not thinking. You find people and you beat them. Maybe not in real life. Maybe not. But, recognize Vegas autonomy until we straight up annex them all. I'll go in there first. I don't care. 
Rubber refinement. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Additional storage. Also, so I think. No, I don't think that was a comment for this video. That's a comment for another video. Thank you, claim jumpers. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, that'll be good. Doshu. Last lodge. Um, actually. Withered dogs. Oh, forgers join the United States. I would like that one a lot. It doesn't look like we can get these guys here. So, all seven of you guys, head on over here. Teach these guys a very nice lesson of what it means to be an American. Because, as we established earlier, freedom is non-negotiable. Well, we have a jewel and a crown under our governors. The U.S. has prospered. We built towns, roads, communities, and dreams. One of our advisors noticed today, while walking through New Canaan, that has become a beacon in the wasteland. But still, it isn't perfect. Though flawed, the imperfections give a character to this jewel. On our nation's crown, spectacular indeed. And we got some research to do as well. Well, we got to talk about new, new Vegas. Good evening, New Vegas. This is Mr. New Vegas. Announcing that Arcade again has defeated Mr. House in the city's first free election since, wait, this is right, 2075? Mr. House's late game efforts to get out of secure Tron boat appears to have been stopped due to some carrier's influence as elections were conducted with minimal violence. Gannon was seen flipping a gambling chip outside the Lucky 38 and has announced that he and his partner will be moving in shortly. Mayor Gannon has indicated that he will move for greater ties to the United States of America, and on that note, folks, let it, let it it's time to play it. This is how we party. One of the more recent pre war songs we salvaged from the wastes. If you like news, then you're gonna love our next segment. We annex New Vegas, get political power, and remove the House wins all. Always wins. Oh, okay then. Uh, the house always wins. Unassimilated refugees, large administration. Not bad. I kind of like that. Three families. So, so, da, da, da. House always wins. Do we have that? Army reserves, New American heroes. Horses. EPA. Uh, well, you got a lot of natural spirits here. Demo Department of Education. What is that one? Fiat currency, of course. Fruits of irrigation. Gun runners. Um, I'm not seeing it, but okay. I did want to recognize their autonomy, though, so... Yeah, that's very weird. That's very, very weird. We have eight days left, so we actually won't be able to get this one done. Um... Awkward, then. Well, uh, you know what? How we do FA. So focus autocomplete, so it's focus dot no checks. Uh, we can do that one. So, yeah, pretty much. And then... The Minister of Combat, uh, Commerce. Mr. House's reputation precedes him. Recognizing his power and good intentions of the United States, he's joined Grant's cabinet. Who better run the Chamber of Commerce? So, that's very weird. Oh, there we go. Now get the House always wins. Mr. House surveys the enclave from a monitor. What I'm offering you is a ground floor opportunity in the most important enterprise on Earth. What I'm offering is a future for you and what remains of this human race. The delegation applauds and soon as staff is set up to serve the Vice President. But why does it feel like he got the better end of the deal? Give more political power? Okay, so that's what the House always wins. This is fine. Interesting. And they're, they're still gone. Okay. All right. Whatever. Oh, man. Look at all this stuff we got at core. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. And, uh, and we are at war with one of those Colorado nations. I don't remember their name. That's all right. Go ahead and get all this stuff uh, done. That'd be really good, actually, to get it all done if we can, because this will give us cores and pretty much everything, which would be nice. But obviously, uh, actually, we might be able to get a lot of this stuff done, actually. As uh, so we're going to go to war with a bunch of other nations. Yeah, I think I'll save Mexico for the next episode. The last episode. Uh, I need to play as a Nevada route sometime. Probably later later in 2021. But if you're watching this sometime other than 2021, well... No, no. <laughs> Alright. What's next? This one? Sure. Why not? Security to Baggers? Hexy Lou. Sure, why not? Become a puppet. Federal, federal, federal. There's a lot of Lou's around here. All right, then. We got the Withered Dog Regions under us. Thank you very much. Um, Let's see. Oh, got some divisions here, huh? All right, there you go. And actually, we have some APC divisions. I'd like to make them 40 combat width, but that might not be in the best interest for us because it just takes us up so much flipping supply. Now, that's 40 combat width. Supply is 2.1. They do got quite a few suppression, but reconnaissance isn't too bad. This looks a lot very good, though. Wow. And what if we throw on maintenance? And what else? Logistics, maybe? Supply use drastically decreases. Drastically, 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 while giving us some reconnaissance. Sure, why not? Okay. So we got those guys we can use. We got some tank divisions. This is 16 combos, which isn't bad. Organization for 13 is just god-awful. That's why we always got to throw on some APCs. It doesn't lower your armor too much, so... And now it's... Uh, what is this? 28... 
Ooh, we can go up to four of these and six of these guys. 31 organizations, not too bad. You still have 37-ish armor. And yeah, overall, not too bad. We could probably do that. And go ahead and throw on the same thing, maintenance and logistics, because that'll save us a lot of supplies. So there you go. How many tanks do we have in APCs? Not bad. And tanks are where? Did I pass it? I must have already passed it. We got some chariots, but no thanks. I don't want to see that stuff. I don't want to be tempted to use such things. 71. That's not very much. I want you three to become APCs. I want you to become a tank. There you go. See what we can do. It won't be perfect. Give us some time, and we'll have it done, though. Um, we got a lot of infantry equipment, which kind of is okay, but not great. Uh, where are we? They're probably at the top. Thank you. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. There you go. Good enough. Good enough for us right now. All right, so we got to hopefully annex these guys peacefully. Baggers, the last lodge. We need to straight up just annex them. So, technically, we did get the things here. So, oh, yeah, we do want to go to war with these guys. Let's just go and just fight on them. That might just make it easier on us. 40 days, not too bad. Let time go on. Doesn't matter. Get some att attack planes. It's fine. Improve the planes that we currently have. <sighs> we could upgrade them, I suppose. Cool. Reliability is kind of down. And boom, 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 boom. All positive. Sounds pretty good to me. Cool. And let them go on. Here we go. Better APCs? Sure. Oh, yeah, pretty much. Better APCs already. Very nice, very nice. A couple days left. But then we're going to go just go ahead and do... Oh, wait. They already must have... The last lodge. We just had the option to annex them. Okay, so we really got to keep an eye on this then. Uh, let's wait them. And then we can annex them immediately. So we have these three. Let's save our PP for right now. And we should do okay. I'll kill off those guys. You guys come over to where? You guys will help concentrate on this side of the border when we fight the, the muties. So that'll be fine. And we can get some more army XP because we can. Uh, anything else while we're waiting? Down Mexico way? We could send stuff, but I don't really feel like sending stuff for now. We'll give a... a actually, do they have claims on all the territory here? Oh, that is a missed opportunity. Well, then again, this is not... Is that Mexico? Well, yeah, maybe it is, actually. Yuma is, n is American. Look at this. Yeah, that's Yuma's American. Yeah, they don't have claims on all this stuff, which I think is a big old mistake, but whatever. Vault City, once again, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Return rollers, yes. Wasteland tanks, yes. And waterproof ceiling, long boat hulls, yes, yes. New Reno, yes, yes. Area 51, yes. And let's go ahead and maybe make a few or one canoes. Actually... Um, just make one, yeah, make one for now. That's fine. Are we ready to proceed? I think so. Shouldn't be that bad, right? How much damage are we going to be doing here? Not enough. Point one, eight, nine, fourteen, twenty-four, twenty-five. 24, It's definitely a mixed bag. Not enough gunships. Never, ever, ever enough gunships. Oh, who's doing that? Hexy Lu. Peace, peace, peace. Courier says rejoin. Yes, go ahead and do that one. We gotta do those fast. So, all right. How many men have we lost? 118 versus 6,000. Not bad. And now, or at least soon, we could oh open the nursery. The EPA had <clears throat> its own plans to survive the war. The Gek might rebuild civilizations, but what are the buffalo, the wolf, the bald eagle, the Mothman? To that end, the EPA prepared a facility to revive a great nation's wildlife. The Good Earth. The nursery is a pre-war facility buried in a remote valley led by pre-war AI who called herself Diana. Although the EPA thinks we could use a facility to terraform the wasteland into a paradise, Diana refuses uh, to aid us and claims we'll squander her gifts. If we can get her cooperation, we could rebuild the American biospheres and restore bald eagles, buffaloes, and woolly mammoths to the American wilderness. Which actually sounds like a lot of fun. You guys are going to concentrate yourselves right there and annihilate them. Persuade Diana to aid us to heal the wasteland. Unlock several gecks from America. Enclave rebuilding your country one town at a time. Is every pre-war AI insane? Shut off the power. I'll do that one. Cool. More gecks. Gek us up. Puppet. Industrial support. Um. Ah, Garden of Eden. I thought we did this one. Let's come down to... Anything else down here? So we could speak. There you go. We still have four more, which is nice. Uh, give us some time. Get our guys up here. How many... Tanks and such do we have? 300 some, that's not bad. Motorized vehicles, we don't unlock any of them. Tanks and APCs are bust. 
cool cast is looking not bad. We could probably use a couple of these guys. I know I could get these to our puppet, but I don't care. I really don't want to be bothered with it. Waste any APCs, thank you. Thank you. Keeping an eye on this and carriers, carriers. Last lodge. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Hmm. I thought that we already did that. Yeah, it's kind of bugged or something that they can just raise up the conscription level or whatever or their thing. Don't like that a lot. I really don't like that. Where's the thing about uh, development projects? Show it to that one. Recumulative things. Hoover Dam. Rebuilding the Pacific Northwest. Exilu. Let's see if they join us first. Let's keep some PP for now. Local recruitment. No strange places. Dalmax go away. Investigate rumors. Oh, we need. Oh God, do we hit the we hit the thing? We must have hit it right. The counter here. We're gonna get rid of a lot of this stuff. Oh my goodness. There you go. That should help us out. Okay, 1.7 million is good enough. Now we have it there. Let's investigate the rumors first. Are we ready to go? Are we going to go? Oh, jet attack planes are nice, but not as good as what we currently have. Enclave divisions, not bad. We could probably start cutting this, these down quite a bit more. Oh, I don't care. Just poop them out. There you go. And thank you. What happens if we go to Warden immediately? Right, you guys are over here. You guys are down here. And have a good old time with them. Do we have a Navy yet? Yeah, we do. Train indefinitely, led by Admiral Benjamin Payne. Ah, Benjamin Payne, hello. Let me make sure we're actually repairing that. So they're going to attack us immediately. Not bad. Kind of expected, honestly. And then... Oh my goodness. Tons and tons and tons of planes. Oh my goodness, yes. You can do this stuff too. Um, bomb that, bomb that, and bomb that. There you go. And we're gonna throw you all right there, because you can. All right. So, oh, oh, they have a fat navy. Wow. All right. So this is glitch. We can't see any how much they have. So manpower wise, they're at one hundred twenty thousand. Let's go in. And we're about to get navy invaded in west, northwest California. Never mind. We already have. All right. Kill them off. Long bullet holes are nice. About 10 air damage. Not enough. Frankly, honestly speaking, it is not enough. Uh, was that 149 we just saw there? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe 14.9. It's probably more like 14.9. You guys, don't worry about that. Head on over here. I wonder how, much, how many casualties we're inflicting. I'd love to know. Because even though we're using infantry, we have a lot of air support. I mean, my goodness. It's probably the most air support I've used, almost ever used. Alright, so that's all going on. Yeah, look at that. Uh, we try to annex them, but it didn't work. So let's do it. Just, we'll just do it one at a time. Doshu Lu becomes or joins us. Keep this one open, and we'll do it immediately to annex them. I think that's the only thing we can do. What about this one? It's not a puppet. Okay. All right. Where's Doshu Lu? They're not here. Oh. I guess we annex them. Okay, then. Uh, Hexilu. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong, but whatever. How about some regulation overrides? Oh, more south second. Oh, we get 25% less HP. Is that a good thing to have? I don't know about that, man. God, I wish we could see the casualties. The Chosen One's trial. The Chosen One's trial was never in doubt, even if Granite had suspicions about the Enclave's experiments on the oil rig in Navarro. Too many members of the Enclave blamed the Chosen One for deaths of friends and family, and propaganda blamed the Chosen One for stopping the Enclave's medical assistance to a royal's tribals. And so, the Chosen One was found guilty of supporting slavers in the Dem, of killing miners in Broken Hills, of smuggling the liquor into the Vault City, of aiding cultists in San Francisco, and of course, of treason against the U.S. government. The only question was their fate. Firing Squad? And a show of compassion, life, and solitary confinement. I like that one for now. Area 51. With Area 51 under control, the Enclave scientists are sifting through realms of pre-war data. It appears that pre-war U.S. was monitored by vast intellects, cool and unsympathetic, and the technology was studied by the military. We can pick this research up, but there may be consequences. Let us press every button we can find. I love pressing buttons. Especially other people's buttons. Sometimes. Oh, that hurts us. It's all right. Um, actually, can we not build anything else up here? So Hexy Lube, we gotta keep it on that one. Are we not building up all the stuff? I guess we are not connected completely yet, but hmm. New Mariposa. Oh, they decrypted their stuff. I forgot about this stuff. Oh, that's all right. Doesn't really matter too much, honestly. We're gonna gas, gun them down. We're not gassing here. Maybe we are gassing there. That'd be kind of cool. We could. 
Uh, let's look at, look at their manpower. I should look at their divisions as well. They've lost around 40 to 50,000 manpower. Not bad. They capture the ward. Delightful. Hexilu, keep our peepee -pee for now. So we're doing stuff down there. That's fine, 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 fine. Um, sponsor Patriot movie. Let's do this one. Cost of war support or army XP. We'll be fine with that. How are you guys doing it here? Doing more than fun. I doubt anyone really has any upgrades yet. And we do have to keep an eye on our energy cells, so actually... Since it's going to take energy cells to make these guys anyways. Let's do that anyways. There you go. Well, I got a lot of infrastructure up here. Lots of energy stations, because we're going to need them. Good job, guys. Good job. Now this Cascadia kind of exists. Sort of. We have four naval XP. Not a lot. Not a whole lot. Uh, we almost have 200 here. I suppose we could do it. Probably not going to be worth doing. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have clicked on that. Oh, well. Economic restrictions. Even if we can't annex them peacefully, we have other ways of making them join us. Much more fun ways of making them join us. Advanced power systems. Nice. Nuclear powered attack planes, because we can. Yep, just kind of pushing them all over. Yeah, I'll save Mexico for the next episode. How are you guys looking down here? Um, Rangers skip. 16,000 manpower. That's a lot more manpower than I thought you guys would have. Mercenary city. Clean water is pretty good for you guys. Wealthy, of course. Militia commanders. Wall construction. New schools. Unassimilated refugees. Pretty normal stuff, I would say. Cool. Still investigating rumors, and that's really fine with us. Oh, we're doing quite well up here. Well, I'm just keeping this up open. Just so we can keep an eye on it. Um, I want to head down here, guys. Probably. Alright. And they have another open hole there. God dang it. Where are you guys going? Seriously? Guys? Just come here. There you go. Alright, three days left. Two days. One days. No, oh, the side looks nation, huh? Alright, so. Hexy right there. Do it immediately so they can join us. Waste any NPCs are nice. Get some more of that stuff. That's good, 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 good. Pursuit. Next time we'll be prepared, which kind of sucks, but whatever. And then we got to keep an eye on the last lodge as well. Multi-deck construction. Honestly, we'll probably just pair drop into New Victoria, but we'll see. We will see. Let's repair the next dam. Yes, that'd be very good. NCR dollars. I can invest in some military academy because we can. The Legion marches, but too bad the Legion is dead. Guys, would you like to move your chubby little enclave power armor legs? Would you like to do the same thing here? Okay, they don't. Okay, then. You guys suck. There you go. Alright, last Lodge Areno. And these guys are just sucking on a lot of infrastructure problems. Gotta love the suck. Last Lodge, please. Last Lodge. Oh, we actually lost some planes. Oh, yeah, they have a big old navy, which makes sense, but still. Last Lodge, please. Yes. It will be muy bueno if you join us. There you go. Do it immediately. Alright. More soldiers, soldiers, soldiers. Thank you, thank you. Oh, Yakum. Oh, there we go. I was like, Yakumo, we need, really need that one? Cool. That was pretty easy. I wonder if you've got gunships like us, and yeah, it's going to be super, super easy. Um, I think next episode we'll start off taking out New Victoria and then focus down south. But what do we have unlocked now? Another uh, focus? Ding, 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 ding. Oh, Starlight Express. Ah, for the Great World of the Coast, Starlight Railway connected to the cities of the West Coast. It can do so again. Very nice. Defensive industrial support, not bad. Um, I don't know. Oh, that'd be nice to have just one solid front line. I know the infrastructure kind of sucks down here. Don't do that, it's fine, doesn't matter. 
Oh, that's not good. What is this? Oh, those guys. I don't really care about those guys. Oh, yes, please do that. I don't think there you go. And to help you guys not get a ton of me, what if we would have gave them... Hmm. There you go. Environment ceiling. Very good. Grab some of that too. Now we could do this peacefully. Or maybe we'll just do it now. Hmm. As long as we can land our guys, that's all that really matters. And we don't want to pair drop. Uh, but you guys are all right there. We'll probably end up losing planes here. Ah, uh, might as well try it here. If it doesn't go well, then I'll do it off screen. Bing bong boom. And. Uh, plenty of gunships actually actually do some damage here. Bing bong bingo dingo. And transports. Because I know we're making transports. Nuclear jet bombers aren't too bad, but. Kind of prefer the, the gunships. Transports, here we go. Alright, so you. Actually, you know what? It's probably easier to do it with you guys. So let's just. Actually. I don't think it really matters if we do it like this. So if we do it from here to there. Here to there. Here, Lopez Island, to New Victoria itself. I'm probably going to end up killing these, oh, all these guys off, probably. But you never know. And go to there. Cool. I'm not sure how many of those there are. I just did. And there you go. We click it again. One, 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 six. Not bad. All right. Let's do the next group here too. Go and make some stuff here as well. Go and make some anti-air because I, I guess I misclicked there. And actually, since we're here, let's go and get rid of some of these planes. Because, good God, I hate having all these extra little planes here. Get out of here. I wish it was like an auto transfer button. Like, oh, I only want to use this type of fighter for now. Any other fighters, just give it to our allies. Just hold it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to feel it. I don't want to know of its existence. I wish it was something like that in the game. Maybe someday. A YouTuber can dream and hope. And now you guys are going to basically do the same thing. And what is, is there a, there is no short key, key for that. That sucks. We'll go from the side. Yeah, I'm not going to be very, very accurate with this. We're just going to land all the guys here. We're going to sacrifice all these guys if need be. Make sure we take the air base as, as well. There's so many guys here. And two transport wings, so. We're definitely going to be losing some power armor. But power armor is not easy to make, but it'll, it'll get made again. Not super worried about it. Nanaimo, or something like that. And go to Duncan. Like donuts. And Comox. No, I'd rather do it all around here. Are we good? Yes, we are. We're very good. Cool. And we'll have to manually justify, probably, which is totally fine. Nuclear attack, attack plants is fine. Get some jet fighters is fine. Whispers of Hope. I love Whispers of Hope. Actually, keep an eye on this. Uh, there you go. Thank you. That makes it go away. Well, uh, there we go. If we do that, will they really join the faction? Probably not. Um, some couriers. This is who Heaven's Gate next. We have enough PP, hopefully, for that. And it's going to take us how long to get this one done? That's not bad. L less than a month now? That's pretty good. Ooh, who's over here? Ah, well, the Mexican group. That's fine. Cool. Anything else? Doesn't look like it, no. Uh, maybe do that. Is that one or the other? That one or the other? Combat Legion stuff. Ah, uh, probably not gonna remove that. We didn't do this one, obviously, or we didn't do this one, but that's fine. I think we're pretty much done with all the focuses. There's not really much left. I need to choose one of these two. We can't do that one because we didn't do, choose to lock. So I guess we're done with the focus tree. Rant, Ranger skips war on drugs. Not content with running the Mexican reclamation zone, Ranger skips has been conducting their air raids across the city of California to cartel lands. This would be fine, or at least not bad, if it wasn't for the fact that these raids are crippling some of the armies that stand between Santa Ana and America. What should we do about this meddlesome amigo? This is the worst, world's smallest pit boy playing the world's saddest song. <laughs> well, this will weaken the cartels the people of Mexico will be pleased. Make them stop. Send some vertebrates to assist. I don't want to lose war support. I love the better tanks. Vroom, vroom, everybody. Vroom, vroom. When you're done, vroom, vroom, and go vroom, vroom even more. All right, screw it. Uh, you guys become tanks. And you guys become APCs. Banish scouts. That sucks. Well, crap. Defensive online, that's good. 
Um, baggers, two beds, Silex, that's fine. Heaven's Gate, we're really gonna focus on these guys. Oh, we can do all the stuff up here too, that's very nice. Um, that stuff's okay. Hoover Dam. Uh, procurement of thing. Wait, I thought the group went missing. Well, that's not good. Yeah, I guess that's not very good for us then. Whoopsie! Care package? 5,000 money is not bad. The Hotfoot Atomic Reactor. Before the Great War, the Hotfoot a hot foot reactor produced much of America's plutonium and energy. Although it's currently occupied by ghouls, if we deal with them, we can restore the planet, revive the region. Obviously, how we treat ghouls will affect the outcome. Mr. President, the engineers at Hanford Reactor said have reported ghoul squatters to refuse to leave. The ghouls claim they have maintained the plant since the Great War and demanded compensation for repairing the facility. We could force them out, but they could damage the plant on the way out, and the resistance to radiation may be useful. What should we do? Give them some plasma grenades. That sounds like a lot of fun. Give them some stock and the new Cascadian Energy Company. Dredging ha Portland's harbor. Damage from the Great War and the pirates of the Maw have rendered Portland's harbor useless for deep sea vessels. If we repair this, we can begin to restore Portland to its pre war glory. With the destruction of the Maw, we need to decide what to do with the pirates who made it home. We could scatter them through the waste, but some of the pirates claim that we are engaging in aggressive commerce given the lack of protection for shipping in the region. Imprison the leadership and scatter them through the waste or use them to revive the U.S. Merchant Marine. Sounds like a good idea. And do that too. And keep an eye on this one for Heaven's Gate. Heavens, heavens, heavens. Oh, heavens. The trolls of the war. And we've broken the troll war, but that just left us with a group of super mutants under our rule. We'll need a solution to the problem, and how we handle super mutants will determine our options. The troll war gave a rise to an odd conundrum, although obviously you will execute the war criminals. A super mutant who used to live in Vault 6, Betty has claimed that she and many of the super mutants are victims of circumstance, and they treated humans under the rule no worse than neighboring tribes would have. But Betty, based on her vault education, has invoked constitutional claims on behalf of her and the other super mutants and asks and demands a place in the United States. And of course, a captive population of super mutants could have some economic applications. Cute, but no reason to deviate from standard procedures, or honest labor will make them honest er. men. Yes. Reclaim in Seattle. With the defeat of the Washington Brotherhood, restoring the greatest city of the Pacific Northwest. I don't know about that, but we've heard about the Washington Brotherhoods worshipping a dark foundry, but as we dig them out of the ruins of Seattle, it appears the truth is more prosaic. Now, the Zack supercomputer survived the war and has been advising the Washington Brotherhood in exchange for resources. Hard to imagine anyone would be dumb enough to follow a supercomputer, but it's picked up a great deal of knowledge and advanced about the wasteland. Another mad pull AI pull the plug. Copy its data banks while it tries to save while it tries to solve pie. This will probably work out for us a little bit better. And north to Alaska. The Washington Brotherhood's databanks hold, told or told of pre-war American soldiers designed to slumber through a nuclear war in Alaska Nights. We should send an expedition to wake these fine men and women. The men and women who missed the end of the world stumbled out of the suspicion or suspended animation pods looking at the oddly short men and women who handed them blankets and soup that tasted almost like chicken. Don't worry, said one of the nurses. It's been a while, but on behalf of the Enclave, let me assure you that the Star Spangled Banner yet waves over the land of the free and home of the brave. You honestly didn't miss much. Ah, oh, that's cool. I got some divisions. That is an interesting type of division. Thanks for playing, though. <laughs> All right, keep an eye on Heaven's Gate, and we still got to do this one, too. Is it because we have... Oh, my gosh. Why? Why? We make way too much infantry equipment, and capitulating enemies doesn't help us when we try to do this, too. And there we... I apologize for clicking... There. Oh, yes, here we go. Hopefully, we don't need too much of a navy actually for this. We have a total of 4 XP. El Vaquero. For some reason, the fate of the Mexican reclamation zone has attracted interest from across the wastes. A ghoul from New Vegas has become a come down Mexico way and offered his services. The old gunslinger apparently fought against bandits in Arizona and Mexico in the past and offers his services for the people of Mexico in the fight against Santa Ana. Time was, he was a pretty good shot with a pistol. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Nice. Awesome, awesome, and let's go to war and see what type of magic we can cook up. Oh, we can go to war immediately. Cool. Can we go in? Let's go! Oh, God. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. I've already lost a lot of divisions. Oh, boy. Force the attack. Both. Everyone force the attack. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Oh, this is a mess. This is a gigantic mess. Oh, no wonder. They've got a ton of divisions here. Holy crap. Great war APCs are nice, though. Don't let us down, boys. We're losing so much power armor. We almost have the capital. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, actually doing this is insane. Yeah, we lost a lot of missions. Whoopsie. That's what the Enclave is here for, though. Restoring America. And that's what matters. They knew what was they knew what was going to happen.
Well, that wasn't very good. Can we actually go in? No, we can't see how much. We lost at least one division, though, so that kind of sucks. But it is what it is. Hello? Hello? Alright, so you guys, you did great. We lost a couple divisions here and there, but I thought we did great. You guys, this was... Oh, God. Oh, if I put you in the water, you actually might literally die, so... Go in there. Ooh. Guys, go, 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 go. Seriously, they should not be stopping you at all, really. Um, we should probably get these guys done before anything else, right? Spread out like cancer, come on. Assume your positions. War crimes, what? During a, a just struggle to liberate America, American forces engage in what some might call war crimes against the civilian population. Fake news. Pictures of the incidents have been released in newspapers across the United States and have been greeted with condemnation by the New World Party. Punish the troops. Sadly, the free press will be critical of offensive wars against settlers and tribals. What else is going on? In times like these, we need all distractions. War crimes. What a bunch of fake news. The comics? Yes. Head straight into there. Keep an eye on Heaven's Gate, please, and thank you. <clears throat> Not bad. Oh, we can probably get it up. Wasp up? There you go. And... Come on. I don't care that they're coming down here at all. Good. Good. But you're going to immediately become one of these guys. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need Brotherhood recruits. Don't need militia anymore. Overall, not too bad. Very... And I wouldn't say scary, but it was a little an anxiety ridden, maybe a little bit. Oh, we just took him out. Nice. Uh, just sending that many guys down into like eight divisions. A little crazy, not gonna lie. Um, we could have next to these guys, but they're busy killing each other. Circle, Circle Junction still exists. Well, it seems like we must teach these people a valuable, valuable lesson of peaceful reunification with the American hotland. The true America, the one that bleeds red, white, and blue for each of you. And don't forget me. Cool. Cool. And give me one, two. Cool. Go on when you can. Let time go on. Because we'll come back up there in a little bit. But give us some time first. That's all done. That's actually really nice. Get some robots, I guess. Uh, what else do we have down here? Oh, we need more composite materials and such. It's fine, it's fine, whatever, whatever, whatever. All that stuff is done. Infantry stuff should all be done as well right now. We need some turbo plasma rifles, but we gotta wait for that. Briggs, some bear packs, even though we don't need the ships anymore, but okay. Steam paddle steamers. Paddle me, paddle me, paddle me. And can we core anything else? That's 21 days. Uh, yes, we can. 600,000 men, not enough. Of course, not enough. Where are you guys at? Kind of hanging out, huh? I mean, we could peacefully annex them, but we'll see what happens. Cascadia is a, kind of a mixed bag right now. It's baggers. Oh, actually, you guys might be a group we want to take out like this. Heaven's Gate is close. Ten days. Not bad. And hopefully we can take these guys out very, very quickly. Ah, yes. A great war tank. Beautiful. Ship stuff. Might as well keep going with this, right? Wait, are these not the exact same? Huh. Okay, well, whatever. Yes, join us. And send them to the two pads, because I'm completely ignoring Texas. Actually, we might have two more episodes after this, then. I don't know. There's a lot of nations we still have to take out. So, we'll see what happens. I may make two sh smaller episodes, but we'll see. Uh, become the federal... What? I thought we already got these guys to become this. That sucks. And it should take too much longer to go to war with these guys, right? Right? Yeah, about 10 days. That's not, that's not too bad. Going to improve some infrastructure over here. I don't want to have too many supply issues, so. There you go, there you go, there you go, there you go, there you go. And just in case, get some planes and some radar. Nice. Actually, can we do have this so unlocked? Uh, that's all done. This side. Oh, I forgot some stuff over here, too, but that's okay. Advanced fuels. I'll come up over here then. Some of that good stuff, and let's grab some of this good stuff. I'm ignoring research speed, but whatever. 
go straight on in. That'd be very nice. Actually, how are you guys doing down here? Oh, there's a lot of issues down here. Oh, not good. Yeah, I should have realized that a bit earlier, but whatever, that's fine. Well, I have this area taken over pretty darn quickly, hopefully at least. Oh, one division versus nine. Goodbye. Would you guys like to go take out the capital? Circle Junction is a nice place this time of year. Scrap bots are very good too. But, I think that'll conclude today's episode. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we will finish off the North, hopefully annex more people, and maybe even take out some of Mexico and Texas. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous enclave. Rest of your day.